Okay, this is an Epson Workforce 2860, and it's been giving me an ink error. I thought it was because I was using generic ink, which by the way worked just fine for quite some time. Then um, it ran out of color ink. I replaced all the color inks with generics. It worked fine. Um, I bought a black one that was the brand name and it decided that it wasn't going to recognize the brand name after um, having all um, generic uh, colors. So I went ahead and replaced all of them to the brand name Epson Ink. Um, it was giving me an error forever. I reached out to someone they said that it was really common and they had to fix these a lot but ended up being too busy to come and do it uh, the work here because I really didn't know what was going on so um, we're going to see if this works in about four minutes it looks like but what had happened is I have removed all of the ink cartridges and replaced them with non-brand name. Then I replaced them again with the brand name. I powered off the unit completely and unplugged it, removed all of the cartridges. This looks good. Turn the unit back on was trying to go and adjust the settings and uh, to minimize the grayscale printing and it's a very quick system so you have to know exactly where to go before you go in there um, so I actually didn't get to get to the grayscale settings before uh, it determined that my ink cartridges were not being read was an error and so I took the ink cartridges out cleaned them and found that one of the keys to the inside of the mach machine was not working so look we have success lovely so and by key in case you don't know what I mean forgive me for being so forceful for this machine but I'm going to show you what I mean by keys. Actually, do not know if that's the correct term. A little bit nervous for taking this out. Okay. Those are the keys. I'll show you right here. These are the keys. There are two rows of keys. There's a top row in which you have four keys. There was a bottom row in which you have five keys. And they slide into here and alternate. So the bottom row is just a tiny bit lower than the top row. The tool that I used to take out the key, which I found laying down in here, it was laying in the bottom of the tray where the ink cartridge is supposed to lay. Um, it was just very small and silver and I had never ne noticed them before, but I took a simple magnet that I had to lift it out and mind you, I realized that could destroy the motherboard on the ink cartridges, but still I took it out with this. Um, I inserted it back in here with these tweezers and then I pushed it down into place all the way and I heard a slight clicking with this um, nail file. So at that point, as you witnessed, um, it seems to have resolved the problem, but I did 
return the Epson cartridge in here. Let me just check and see which ones I'm using for color real quick. Yeah, they're Epson as well. Okay. So I have all the brand names in. And pretty much over this printer. I was just shopping for another one. And most of them are sold out. Uh, or double the price of what they typically sell for. So, okay. Now that I did this, I'm getting another error. Let's go ahead and see. Terrific. This thing is so picky. I am not really a fan of how complicated they make the um, ink cartridges. Mm. Okay, so you have to wait for all these to light up. And then you can go into settings. You can see by the time it gets over there, it's going to shut this part down. Just see. I think it's gonna work. Okay. I'm just printing a test page. Looks good. It's a little out of alignment, which you can see the first line being cut off, but uh, for the most part, the color skew is right, and I'll update the software and see if that doesn't fix it. But anyways, if you have a printer error, um, that your ink cartridge code is not recognized, then it could be that one of your keys have just fallen out or that you need to clean the inside of your printer. By doing that, you should resolve the issue. Thank you for watching. Please comment if you found any other fantastic resolutions for this terrible printer. <laughs> Thank you.